Good morning. This is Pastor Jason of Kona Faith Center with the word for today. And the word for today is lordship. Interesting term, lordship. It means to place oneself under the direct control of another. The idea from scripture is that we have to renounce lordship of self lordship of what the world values, lordship of earthly pursuits, lordship of what is highly esteemed among men, but is an abomination in the sight of the Lord. And then we need to place ourselves under the lordship exercised by Jesus. Surrender all to Jesus. Submit to the authority of Jesus and the authority of his word. Jesus said you can only serve one master. You cannot serve both God and the world system. Now there's an interesting set of verses that don't seem connected in Luke today. Since John, the kingdom has been preached and everyone's pressing into it. The word will never fail. God hates divorce. And they're sandwiched by two parables. If we look at the whole chapter as being about lordship and specifically the lordship of Jesus, then all of a sudden these seem connected and they make sense. We need to be good stewards of the resources our Lord has entrusted to us. This means we must submit ourselves to his lordship so that we use those resources in a way our Lord intends. They're his. Faithfulness in stewarding our Lord's resources leads to increase in blessing, but be clear, we can only serve one Lord. We cannot serve Jesus and the world system. We need to recognize that the world system values greed and corruption and theft and lies and cheating, and all of those things are an abomination to Jesus. Recognize that it takes a bold, forceful, even violent presentation of the gospel because it takes a bold, forceful, even violent repentance and rejection of the world system to renounce the world system's lordship and to receive the lordship of Jesus. If we orient our attitudes around our commitment to faith in Jesus, around our commitment to the lordship of Jesus, then all of our relationships, including our marriages, will work and produce what God intends for them to produce. If we will live lives around the lordship of the world system, there is an eternal punishment waiting for us, an eternal separation from everything that is good. A daily dose of the Holy Ghost, a daily dose of the Word, helps us to keep our commitment to the lordship of Jesus. If we don't respond to the authority of the word, we won't be persuaded even by one who rises from the dead. Wow. The concept today is the lordship of Jesus. Renounce, replace, surrender, submit. The word for today is lordship. God bless. Check in tomorrow.